So in Alice's frame, there's no spacing between these events. They happen in the same location along the x-axis. So delta xa is equal to zero. And then plugging this into the Lorentz transformation gives, well, in other words, delta tb equals gamma delta ta. And we recover our previous result. So now let's consider something slightly different. This time, Alice has a soccer ball. And at time ta equals zero, Alice kicks the ball. So event one is Alice kicking this soccer ball. So the ball soars through the air and then lands back down sometime later at event two. The separation between these two events in Alice's frame is delta xa and in Bob's frame is delta xb. So Alice will measure some time delta ta between her kicking the ball and the ball landing. So in Bob's frame, in terms of gamma v delta ta and delta xa, what will Bob measure as the time between Alice kicking the ball and the ball landing? 